Coffee Chat Day 48. Sit down, grab yourself a coffee, enjoy the vibe. So this might not be a surprise if you've watched a lot of the previous coffee chats, but as of right now, life isn't that interesting. So like, I'm just, I'm just sort of talking and chilling and just doing all that sort of stuff. So yeah, like not much to say yet again, but we're still gonna smash down this cup of coffee right after I finish this rolly. Also, the uh, hair tutorial is coming tomorrow for all of you that were looking forward to that. I still feel really bad about missing it because we were meant to do that like two weeks ago. But, you know, with like me getting a cold and all, it was like I just couldn't because I'd just be hacking up my lungs while like, you know, trying to teach you how, how I do my hair. And like it wouldn't have been enjoyable for anyone to watch. Also, we are getting shockingly close to hitting a thousand subs. Like once we get to that point, I already know what I'm going to do for a thousand subs. I'm going to do a live stream of me drinking Jack Daniels. Like drinking whiskey, right? And that's just, that's gonna be it. Like, instead of the coffee chat, it's like whiskey chat, day one. Start off a brand new series. Cats messing around in the bathroom. Also, for anyone that is new here, uh, well, if the cat comes in, you'll be able to see her, but I have a cat, by the way. And coffee is really good. Like, I have to say, and I know, like, at this point it should be obvious, but I have to say coffee is incredible. Actually, this might be day 49. Now that I'm thinking about it, this might be day 49. Huh. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, it'll be corrected, like, the title will be correct, right? But, you know, the intro might be confusing for some people. <laughs> or it could actually be day 48. I, like, I like to think that I was getting into a groove like I knew which days were which but I honestly think I might have confused it up a little bit but ah sure it'll be good it'll be good it'll be good it'll be grand yeah I feel like I need to do something interesting in these videos, even though I know that's like not the core idea behind them. But it's like, I feel like if I'm just sitting here and just like smoking and having coffee, which, yeah, like some days that is incredible because like I have shit to talk about and it's like I can make the video interesting that way. But you know, when it's just me here, like with a coffee and the smoke nothing really much to talk about it feels like whoa you get me like it just feels like i'm not doing this whole youtube thing right i suppose there isn't like really a right way to do it like just making anything and just putting it out there is like good for me like i'm happy just doing that This is more like a, this is more like an internet journal than, more than anything. Like, I, I don't really feel like it has to go much deeper than that. 
Like, I feel like, yeah, that's just the whole channel at this point. Like, you have these sort of advice type videos, and I'm like, those are very similar to, like, my own personal journal entries. Or it's like, I just write down the idea, like, the sentence, and then just write down, like, my thoughts on it. And to be fair, that is, like, how I usually come up with my video ideas. Like, I'll think about a concept that I feel relatively sure that I know what I'm talking about. And then I'll, you know, elaborate further on it. And then I'll record that. And then that's, like, usually how the advice type videos come come together. I was messing around with, like, using a script. Well, back when I first started, I was using scripts and all, but... I messed around with, like, that idea in a few of the upcoming type, like, advice type videos. I didn't really like how it turned out. I felt like I just spoke very unnaturally in those videos. And I feel like that kind of takes away from what I'm, what I was trying to say in those videos. Because I actually felt like the things I had to say were really good, like, I actually feel really proud of what I was trying to convey, but I feel like I messed it up in the way I was delivering it because it felt like I was trying to deliver it a certain way rather than just like letting the concept speak for itself. I mean, nothing much. Well, I could just re-record them, but quite honestly, I'm too lazy for that. But, yeah, you know, like, I'm sure, like, the idea is portrayed. Like, you, you can get, like, the basic idea of what I'm trying to say in those videos. And I do feel like what I am saying is very, like, I don't know, like, I feel like... The videos I'm, like, some of the videos I make can be, like, really helpful for certain people. And that's sort of, like, the whole reason that I put out the videos that I do. Because it's, like, it's less about trying to make myself come across as, like, intelligent. But more about if... Someone watches this video and their life gets better because of it. Like if just one person like feels better with their about their life because of a video that I watch that not I watch that I made, then that's like that's it. Like that's that's what I'm looking for. That's there's no other like motivation for it. It's just if someone feels like their life got better because of something that I said. And even if the chance of that happening is very slim. Like practically 0.01% like of the people that watch the video are actually going to feel better. Because they watch the video. And like 0.01% of people feel like they've yet like... You know, like, I don't know. I'm messing up my words. Like, I'm stumbling over them. But, like, if a million people watch one of my, like, advice type videos and one person really resonates with what I say, that is, that's what I want. Like, I'm putting out those videos for, like, just in the rare case that it might actually help someone. And I don't really, like, want to put it too much deeper than that. Oh. Just got a low battery notification. Phone's at 20%. But, yeah, you know, like, it's... Like, I will say, it is fun watching the numbers. Like, on the YouTube analytics and stuff. But, I try not to let that get to my head. Because I feel like letting it get to my head would be like 
very toxic. Like, I feel like that would take away from what I'm actually trying to do. And I kind of, you know, I kind of don't want to do that. Because I will say, like, in my own personal life, one of my biggest flaws is definitely my pride. Like, I feel like I get arrogant about a lot of things very quickly. And, you know, I, I, I want to try and take steps against that. Because I really don't like being prideful. But I can't deny in the moments where I do feel pride, it feels really good. Like, it feels almost addictive in a way to feel proud about something that you do. And I'm trying to, like, take steps against that. And, like, try and keep myself humble. But, you know, like, some days it's easier than others. Coffee's done. Alright. Uh, that's everything I have to say today. Thank you for watching. And keep running when no one else is.